Microsoft has invested extensively into a very broad and comprehensive set of platforms and capabilities that will meet customers not only where they are today, but also help them stay ahead into the future. One of the things that we're doing with, uh, with Microsoft Azure and, and IoT is this visible light communication, VLC, and every light point is actually flickering at a, at a rate that can't be picked up by the eye, but it can be picked up by the front camera of a device. So we use Microsoft uh, Azure and the solution there to bring back the X, Y, Z coordinates to an application provider to help them with finding the avocados or the screwdriver in the DIY store, for example. We're trying to attach devices to Azure IoT so that we can uh, enable ISVs to write applications without worrying about the security and the connectivity and the embedded things that go on within the devices. So in manufacturing, we move from the enabling IoT devices to connect to the IoT environment and then apply AI to do predictive maintenance and all these kind of solutions. We focus on the engineering, the operations, the industrial side of the business. Microsoft has this beautiful platform that we've built our tools upon and together we bring that to market to add value to our customers. And so a big part of what we're also trying to innovate with Microsoft is find out if we can develop net new delivery models, business models, uh, in, in which we can uh, deliver our solutions and customers can buy our solutions uh, leveraging uh, the Microsoft Azure platform. I think Azure IoT is a leading platform not just because of the deep, powerful capabilities that we've built, but really importantly, the fact that we've built such a rich partner ecosystem on top. You know, we really look at it as we can't be a leader without our partners.